In this question, we are given two statements that convey similar information. Both the remainder and the non-integer portion of the decimal describe the portion of the division that didn't happen cleanly. For example, if we divide 7 by 5, or 7 fifths, the remainder is 2. And the decimal value of 7 over 5 is 1.4. And there's a relationship. It's the remainder of 2 over the divisor, 5, that gives us the decimal portion of 0.4. Therefore, in this case, we can take the remainder of 27 and put it over the divisor in order to get the decimal portion. This allows us to solve for n. We get 27 over what appears to be a difficult to work with number, but then by factoring out threes and twos, we're able to obtain 1500. The correct answer is B.